Well, <laughs> oh, silly me. I didn't realize we'd started, so I was so excited after all the excitement of yesterday. Excuse me while I put away the royal cigarette. Oh, terrible habit. Luckily, the general public don't know. I'm a, I'm a serious drinker and fagger, yes. Uh, Prince Charles here. Uh, sorry, I've got the wrong title. It's King Charles. What exciting, what exciting news, yes. King Charles, everyone. Here, the lovely Camilla, Queen Camilla next to me. Here we have our... Oh, I don't know what I'm going to remember. A bit of con rule, probably. We have our royal, our royal monks. We're celebrating the coronation. Yes, it's the day after we can relax. We can enjoy being the guest hosts of Sadness. Wonderful show here from live from uh, live from um, Brickening Brickenham Palace. Mm. Oh, cream soda! I love it. Mm. Oh, what an exciting day yesterday! Oh yes, lots of this. <laughs> Shame about the weather, but then that's good old blighty for you. And very appropriate. It was pissing down with rain over my coronation, but what could I expect? It was just a shame Mummy couldn't be there to watch it, but then she never could, I suppose. <laughs> oh, what a wise guy I am. Uh, yes, uh, slightly marred by a little bit of protest or trouble at the beginning. Luckily, the police had managed to arrest. Uh, most of the naughty ones in advance using new powers that just came in last week which are slightly suspect. I think Mumsy would have had a little bit of a problem with them. But never mind, as long as it kept the procession nice and cheery, there was only a little bit of not our king, not our king. Oh, shocking. I tell, I, I tell, I plunked my ear in the side they were shouting that. Anyway, there's a slight bit of bother. And just between me and you and the, and the gatepost. A little bit before we started, one of the protesters managed to get through into the royal, into the royal uh, courtyard and managed to glue himself to the side of the royal carriage, the golden carriage, yes. And we couldn't get him unstuck. No, we were running out of time. The police were trying everything. They were trying uh, nail varnish remover, um, uh, syrup of figs. Uh, uh, nothing would remove the, the super glue. So the poor chap was stuck there on the side. Uh, uh, of the carriage. We just had to go with it. We just had to make sure that the television cameras only filmed from the other side. So while you saw us all waving and smiling, uh, there was actually a poor chap stuck to the back of the carriage on the other side. And annoyingly he kept shouting, Where's Diana, Mike? Where's Diana? You married the wrong one. Uh, very, I, I tell you, it was awful. Uh, poor Camilla was very upset. Wasn't you, darling? Yes. Uh, and so we had to wind the window up. Yes, eventually and just shut the poor chap out. Anyway, apparently it's still there, um, but they're working on getting him off the, the coach because uh, we'll need it again, uh, well, possibly very shortly. I don't know how long I've got left um, for the next coronation. So, anyway, damned persistent, these protesters. You have to take your hat, you have to take your crown off to them. Uh, now, speaking of the crown, it's, I've got airmen everywhere. And as you can see, <coughs> it's, it's, not, it's fake airmen, uh, because for the, my, my proper robes, uh, I tucked back in the expensive wardrobe back in the palace. And this is just the, uh, the, the, the shabby Sunday uh, attire. Uh, yeah, it's, it's actually cotton wool, and it's, it's, getting, it's getting ruddy well everywhere. Yeah. Well, we better carry on with one of my favorite songs ever. Uh, would you believe it's called Charlie is My Darling? <laughs> Was on a Monday morning, right early in the year. The char wait a minute, it'd be a Saturday morning. Twas on a Saturday morning, right early in the year of May. May actually the Charlie came, Char Charlie came to our town, the young Chevalier. Oh, Charlie is my darling, my darling, my darling. Charlie is my darling, the young Chevalier. As he was being carried down the street, the city far to view, for there he spied a bonny lass sitting next to him in the window peeking through. It fell, oh, Charlie was my darling, my darling, my darling, Charlie is my darling, the young chevalier. Her name was Camilla, 
her not Diana at all. I asked her on the spot if she would marry me and have a ball. She said, oh, Charlie is my darling, my darling, my darling. Charlie is my darling, the young chevalier. So light he jumped up up the stairs and turtled at the pin. And we say ready but herself to let the laddie in. Oh, Charlie is my darling, my darling, my darling. Charlie is my darling, the young chevalier. He sat his jenny on his knee, all in his finest dress. He asked her to be his queen in me. And to put on her finest dress. Oh, yes, we must look very smart for the coronation, darling. Oh, Charlie is my darling, my darling, my darling. Charlie is my darling, my young cavalier. It's up young heathery mountain and down young scroggy glen. We don't a gang of milk him for Charlie and all his men. Oh, Charlie is my darling, my darling, my darling. Charlie is my darling, the young chevalier. Oh, <laughs> wonderful song, wonderful song. What a coincidence, it's the same name as myself. Charles the Third. Charles the Third, yes. Wonderful. I'm glad to be Charles the Third. Uh, I would like to be Charles the Second, anyway. He, he, he was beheaded. <laughs> of course, uh, uh, I've had a wonderful accordion player uh, from Scotland, uh, Andy Brickin. Uh, he's been performing for me a couple of times, uh, 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 not recently, I might add, but uh, it's about time I got him back into the palace for a private performance, yes. Uh, now, of course, we have, uh, as we have at any prestigious occasion, and of course, particularly the, 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 the coronation, we have the Princess Duchy. Original, yes. What? But what? What is a coronation without a duchy original? Look at these fine biscuits from the Duchy of Cornwall. Hmm. Coincidentally, in by myself, uh, then I never do. Absolutely delightful. Oh. Mm. Now. Ah. Uh. There's a message from Christopher Martin White. This is absolutely spiffing, your sandiness. Are you sitting on your sandy stone? Yes, I'm, <laughs> I'm sitting on my stool, my favorite stool. Yes, I'm sitting, uh, I mean, sitting in the stone of destiny's child. Yes, it's, it's a very musical stone. <laughs> it's been stolen, you know. But we got it back from those naughty Scotch little thieving bastards. <sighs> Well, I don't know if it's a real one, that's the only thing. I suspect the good one's hiding in a cave somewhere up in the north of Scotland. Um, uh, next time I'm up in Balmoral, I'm going to take a particularly long walk and see if I can <coughs> find it. Mm. Now, of course, we can't have a Dutchie original without singing past the Dutchie originals from the left hand side. <laughs> Who's the nation? The version? Music happened to be the food of love. Song to really make you rub and scrub. Pass the duty from the left hand side. Pass the duty from the left hand side. It's a go one, give me music, make me jump and prance. It's a go one, give me music, make me rock and not the dance. Cool and lonely, breezy afternoon. How does it feel when you've got no food? I wouldn't know. How could you could feel it cause it was a month of June? How does it feel when you've got no food? So I left my gate and went out for a walk. How oh, does it feel when you've got no food? I don't know, I've got tons of touchy originals. As I pass the dreadlocks camp, I hear them say, How does it feel when you've got long food? Pass the touchy original from the left hand side. Pass the touchy original from the left hand side. Go go bang 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 go
Fancy, now that's nothing to do with Charles. Oh, and it is, Bonnie Prince Charlie. Oh, God, how did it go? No? Uh, oh, dear, I can't remember. Uh, Flora MacDonald's fan, it's an old tune from 1745. I don't really remember that. Uh, Never mind. Uh, I play it all the time as well. Ruddy and I. Uh, let's just play something random. <laughs> oh, that'll do. Jolly enough, I suppose. I would like you all to pledge allegiance to the show by standing in front of your phone screens and saluting and saying, I promise to follow the royal squeeze box forevermore. I am your liege, sir. I thank you. 
Well, that's enough for today. It's been a super show. Thank you so much. And, uh, well, we've got to get back to doing royal things. We've got some very important business, sir. I'm going to sign off for just now and uh, see you again. Uh, no doubt walking in the uh, grounds of Balmoral, if any of you not his Scots are up there. Oh, I think that last tune I played was called Bonnie Bankery, was it? Yeah, 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 this was Bonnie Bankery. A uh, lovely place. This is very, just down the road from ba Balmoral. Uh, this is kind of like the slum area of Balmoral Bankery, yes. Terribly commonplace. Anyway, thank you. Cheerio. Toodle pip. Whoa, Camilla. That was quite a show, my sexy lady. Yeah. Well, I think we better get back to what we were doing earlier on. Yes, because, darling, you know, it's time for your daily ride. Oh, yeah. Give it to me, Camilla. I'm going to give it to you. Oh, yeah, here comes the girl. Oh, right on the royal throne. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Have I left that on? I don't believe it. I've left that thing on again. It's so embarrassing. Everybody will know. What we get up to after uh, things turn up. Oh, God. How embarrassing.